What's good, rap artists? This is your man, Jimmy Conway from InstantClassicProductions.com. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a list in Aweber so you can have fans sign up and you can promote your music to them on a daily. Stay tuned. My two cents. Alright, I'm back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an email list in Aweber so you could gather new fans and market your music to them. Okay? Now, Aweber is an email service provider that most businesses use to gather information from clients or potential clients. Okay? It's a great way. Uh, what they usually do is they'll uh, create a sign up form here uh, so they can gather names and emails by giving away a free something or other they can give away a free product to get their name and email and then from there they can create messages uh, they can create broadcast messages uh, follow up messages or whatever to keep them engaged with their business but what we're going to do right now to keep it real simple we'll get into everything a little bit later I'm going to show you how to create a list in Aweber so you can start gathering emails from names and emails from people at your shows, people in the street, people that you know that like your music, okay? Uh, this way you get more fans, real fans, engaged in what you're doing, okay? Instead of spamming your stuff online, all right? So first thing we need to go here, you're going to go up here to manage list. Okay, these are all my different lists of email, uh, different list of things I've given away to gather emails from different people. Okay, whether I'm giving away, you know, free uh, information, I'll give away sometimes a free video uh, packed with a lot of information that's helpful. I'll give away sometimes some free beats. I'll give away some free eBooks. You can give away anything for free, and we'll get into that later with the sign-up form, okay? But right now, we're just going to click Create a List. You'll be led to this right here, okay, this page. We're going to set up our list. First thing is putting your company name. My company name is Instant Classic Productions. My website is instantclassicproductions.com. Down here, where it says, what address would you like to include? You have to include, include an address of some form. Uh, my address here is blocked out. Uh, but yeah, you're going to have to do that for uh, spam reasons. And we'll get into that later too uh, on another video. Okay. What sender name and email address should appear with your email? All right. So when I send the email out to a, uh, a potential client, I wanted to say my name, Jimmy Conway. And I wanted to have my email here. This is like, this is not a Gmail email or a Yahoo. This is a company email, you know, from having a, a website. So it's my name, my website.com. That's my email address. Okay. So once you put all that stuff in, you click next. What would you like to name your list? Now you can name your list anything, uh, depending on what kind of list you want to create. Now, as a rapper, you have, you should have different parts to help your um, movement uh, proceed, so to speak. So you're gonna need a list of, first thing you're gonna need is to create a list of fans. That's what, that's what we're gonna do now, is create a list of fans. Later on, you're gonna, you may wanna create a list of producers. And we can even break it down further. You can create a list of, let's say just trap producers. Create a list of, East Coast producers, create a list of uh, potential managers, create a list of anything you anything you want to market to, any any group of people you want to market to, you can create a list for that group, okay? So, my list name, let's just say, uh, I'm going to have to put my rapper, my rapper cap on. If I was a rapper, I'll just say, uh, new, uh, I don't know, new, 
music for fans. Okay. And down here, you just type a brief description of what they'll receive on a daily basis, weekly basis. Um, but let them know in this box here what they'll get. What are you going to send them for free? And what are you going to tell them about in future emails? So let's say in future emails, you're going to be sending, uh, you'll send them a link to your new music when it, when it drops, exclusive music that's not on your mixtape when it drops. Um, anything you're going to be sending to people you want to put in this box here, okay? They give you an example right here, healthy low-fat recipes for every budget sent weekly, okay? Just tell them either weekly or daily so they know how many messages are going to be coming in, okay? And after that, you click, oh, let me put something in here. Uh, you, you will get new messages weekly when we put out new music. Something like that. I don't, I don't know what you want to put. You can make it up, spend time, you know, doing that, okay? Click next up. Okay. Now this is a confirmation. When you when somebody signs up to your email list, a confirmation is gonna be sent to that email first. So they have to click a button before they start getting any more messages from you. If they don't click that button, they're not gonna get the messages from you. So Basically up here, you're going to leave the languages English or whatever you, you know, language you speak fluently. You can change it here. Um, this I would leave alone because this is the email they'll get. This is the e email subject line new fans will get when they sign up to your email list. Okay. It'll be their first name and it'll say confirm your subscription. Then down here it says, please click the button below to confirm you'd like to receive emails from whatever the list name you chose, okay? It says, thank you, and my company name right there, okay? You don't have to do anything with this. I recommend that you leave it alone, uh, but you can mess with it if you want to, okay? And from there, I could just create the list. Approve message and create list. Okay, now, as you see up here, it says current list, new music for fans, okay? So now, what our next step would be, would be to start, uh, would be to create a sign-up form to start gathering emails and, and names of potential fans so you can start marketing your music. It's much better, now say, like right now, if, now, this may not seem like a lot of people, like I said before, but 935 people, if you try to stand in front of 935 people, that's a lot of people, okay? So right now, I can send out an email to 935 people who have signed up to my email list at some time or another, they've showed interest in what I offered them, okay? Um, I can email them anything. I can email them tips. I can email them a new offer I have. I can email them uh, whatever's going on in the music industry or whatever. But as a, as a rap artist, uh, I'll go back to creating lists. The kind of list I would look to create, if I was you, I would create definitely a new fans list. So, um, oh, and I, I'm gonna put you onto a secret at the end. How you're gonna gather your new fans? Because I know we're doing all of this on a computer. It may be hard to bring a laptop with you, but I, I got another secret for you. Uh, just hold on to the end of the video. Um, I lost my track of thought. Oh yeah, you're gonna create your list of new fans you're gonna create a list of like I said new producers like if you're a versatile rapper you may want to have different producers who specialize in a certain craft like even though I make uh, I make a little bit of everything I make East Coast soulful trap beats I make West Coast sometimes I make club beats sometimes my specialty is East Coast underground and soulful hip hop, like 90s style hip hop. So when people come to me, they know what they're gonna get that 90s flavor, okay? Um, 
you want to create lists that are very niche and very specific. Create one, create a East Coast uh, producer list, create a West Coast producer list, create a um, uh, trap beat producer list. And you might want to say, well, how do I get them to sign up to my list? Well, that's going to be really easy. How you get producers to sign up to your list, okay? In my next video, I'll show you how to create a sign up form. But, um, actually, you know what? We can do it now. Because it, it won't take that long. And this way I can save, save time. Alright, so we're going to create a sign up form for people to sign up, you know, to our list. Alright, so we're going to click create a sign up form. And right here, they give us look like a little basic generic sign up form right here. But we could customize this if we want, or we can go up here and we could choose whatever sign up forms we want to use. Um, so uh, let's say I go to popular, and then let's say um, I go to modern or to download. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I like this one because the arrows are pointing to the sign up form and to the email drop here. So I'm going to just hit load template and from here we could, we could click on the arrow, we can stretch this out, stretch it back, um, up here is the header, at the header of the sign up form, if you click there we can type whatever we want into this little box and it will show up in the header form. So if you want to get producers to sign up to your email list, here's what you do. Say you're looking for an East Coast producer like me. Okay, you type in all East Coast, oh no, no, better yet, looking for East Coast producers for a new mixtape. Okay, looking for a producer for my new album. Say, looking for, no, no, no. Yeah, actually put looking for 90s style beats. Okay. Sign up below for possible consideration. Okay. All right. So, so now we're gonna now this you know we have this sign up form. Looking for East Coast producers, or you can switch it for whatever you want for a new album. Looking for 90 style. Let's be specific. Hip hop beats. Sign up below for possible consideration. Alright? So hit save field. Well, actually, what you can do too here is uh, you could create like a little header. Want in on this album? Make it like a little question. Please bear with me because the stuff I'm gonna dropping is gonna be helpful for you. Oh, sorry, hold on. Uh, that's not how you spell want. Want in on this album? Put like a little question mark. Highlight this. You can either bold it. You could change the um, font. Let's say I want Bredania, and let's say I want a font size of 24, and we'll make it bold. Now let's go one plus, let's go 18, here we go. So I see it looks a little bit bolder here, and then you have your information here. 
Now, what you want to do here, what I would do, is another secret that people don't show you. Let's just say field. You can create a new field over here. So let's say you're going to get the producer's name. Actually, what I would do, to be more specific, type, click in here, it'll bring up this field. You can type in producer name. Okay, hit save field. Boom, that shows up there. Click in here, put, go right before the E, put most checked email. Okay, hit save field. All right, now what I would like to do is I leave the re-respect your email privacy here. I leave that. But I click the X where it says powered by Aweber email marketing. I don't need that there. Boom. Okay. So now what I would do next is add a field. Add another one of these fields here. Where a producer can drop a YouTube link to his best song. And tell him you want nothing other than YouTube links or SoundCloud links or whatever you choose. Okay. Whatever platform you're on. I'm going to say YouTube link only. YouTube link only, okay? Hit next. Now, boom. So now I'm going to when I sign up. They have other things you could do here too, but I'm going to keep it real simple for you right now. Um, so now you got the producer's name, most checked email, and a YouTube link to their... like when they sign up to your list uh, it'll tell them that they have to confirm the subscription to click that button I showed you earlier in the list section okay you can also change that to be an audio version video version if you have your own website and you're pretty familiar with uh, creating custom pages you can create a custom page and lead them to that page also Okay, but I'm gonna just leave everything the way it is. You can leave everything the way it is. Uh, I usually put open this in a new window. I leave that checked. Uh, then I go to step three. Oh, it says you must save your form. Well, let's save our form. Okay, here we go. Now it says you get three options. First one, it says I will install my form. This form is if you have your own website, I could put this, I could copy and paste this code, this, HT, uh, this JavaScript into my website here and it'll show up on my website as a, um, as the pop-up, uh, as a sign-up form, excuse me. Um, the second option is if you're not familiar with computer codes and anything techy, you can have a, you can have this sent to your uh, 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 your web designer and have him put this on your on your website. Okay. The other option is probably the one you want to start out using. You can use this uh, this link here. If I copy and I go to a new tab. Paste that code in here, hit enter. That's our sign up form. Boom. So now, this is how you're gonna grab information from different producers or whoever you wanna sign up to your email list. This is how you're gonna get them in. It's 
is a whole page, real clean looking. Not too much to distract people. All they have is one or two options. They can fill this out or they can back out of here, okay? Whew. All right, this is kind of putting two videos in one. I was gonna make two separate videos out of this, but you know, what the heck. Um, oh, another option I was gonna tell you about, the bonus, the bonus at this the end of the video. The bonus I had for you was that um, you can have your phone you could, you could get an app on your phone that you can get people to sign up to your email list. And it's all through Aweber. It's an app, pro, pro, uh, excuse me, it's an app provided by Aweber called Atom, A-T-O-M. And what that app lets you do is that they let you, let's say you have your phone and you have the app installed, you can select what list on the app you wanna sign people up to. Let's say we chose that new fans list. Let's go back to that. New, new music for fans and from there I'll try to see if I can include this in my other video in another video but um okay, uh, I totally lost the, oh with the Atom app you can have people sign up from their phone or their uh, or your what's that iPad, your, your tablet, or your Android phone, okay? It's a, it's a great app. I meet people on the street, you know, if I meet a rapper that's on the street and you're looking for beats, I break out my phone. So I'm here, you have a name and an email address? Sign up here on my phone. And from there they sign up and they get a series of emails from me from that follow-up email series I showed you earlier, the Legacy Follow-Up Series. Legacy Follow-Up Series, excuse me. Uh, it's a little bit early in the morning for me. Um, so yeah, that's that's the, the big tip. Um, so you don't have to have your laptop with you everywhere you go. You can just have your phone and have people sign up for your phone, okay? Whew, I hope this was helpful. Um, if you're a rap artist looking to create an email list, this is how you get started, okay? Um, so far we went through creating a list. Okay, we created our list. And we created a sign-up form for people to sign up to your list and start getting information from you, whether it's tips. You can offer tips on how to rap, tips on... You can offer any kind of knowledge-based tips. You can offer free music. You can offer paid music. So much you can do with an email list. And just imagine if you had 20,000 fans who were interested in your music like, like die hard. let's say you had 20,000 die-hard fans. And let's say you let a, um, you have a new song out. You know, you've been giving them free music, free music. And you have a bonus song that's not on your mixtape or any album. You're letting it go for $1, okay? On Spotify or uh, iTunes. You can literally say, hey, I'm letting this... You can email your list of 20,000 people say, hey, I'm letting this song go for $1. Get it for, get it today for 24 hours, okay? Out of that 20,000 people, let's say 2,000 just put out a dollar. That's $2,000 you just made, okay? That's the importance of an email list. And um, right about now, I'm gonna drop the video. I'm gonna drop a annotation to the video for you to watch why having an email list is so important for a rapper, okay? And I'll also drop why having a website is so important for a rapper also, okay? I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe uh, today. Uh, I'd really love to have you on our team here at instantclassicproductions.com. My name is Jimmy Conway. If you have any comments, leave them below. As a matter of fact, if you have any questions about email lists and Aweber, feel free. I'll leave a link below where you can also sign up for a free trial for 30 days. And uh, that's it. Your man Jimmy Conway from InstantClassicProductions.com. One love.